okay let me give you a demo so let's say okay we'll start all right so you can see this is a dual pendulum and there is a line trails okay i will just remove the trails for now so that you can understand what is happening <coughs> okay so this is the dual pendulum i have mm, turned down the gravity too much so that the pendulum we can see too much of its uh, dynamics so this is a double pendulum dual pendulum and it's in motion with the feedback forces and everything okay and i have attached it with the mouse then i can literally increase the segments of the pendulum I mean i can make it triple pendulum and uh, here it is so that was three points now if i make it four so it will make three segments and there you can see okay so let's go back i'll make it three and uh, this is the segments of the trials which is there i will just make it less 20 and here this is the sampling time of the trials so i will just make it 10 10 numbers up to 10 frames you know yeah so okay i turn this off okay the reason the trials showed up there because the it's an array and in those the points some points are already at zero so it has to move back the points and uh, you know what I mean okay that's cool <coughs> I'll turn high the gravity so yeah you can see the trials appear like frames some discrete kind of frames the reason is i set it like this to make it faster So this is called the dual pendulum. Am I right? Yeah. So okay, if uh, I decrease this to one frame per sampling, sampling each frame, like each uh, loop. So this uh, points of the trials will remain the same, but it will be sampled quickly. So you mean like uh, if it will be sampled quickly then the trials will be look smaller and there you can see because the samples segments are just 20 as I said it.
Okay, so let's get some more crazy action. I'll make the segments means like uh, make it uh, 20, 20 segments of the pendulum means 20 pendulums attached. Each one has 20 trials and the trials sampled at each of the loop. But no, let's make it 10 to make it, uh, you know. Oh shit, it will. Okay. So, you know, each. I didn't set the length of each of the segment. It should be 10. This is the length of each segment. Okay. There you can see now. It appears like a rope and yeah if I turn off the trials so <coughs> that is how it is looks really satisfying it has the feedback as well it can transfer the force behind forward backward every direction So that is how it is uh, the dual pendulum and uh, okay and what is this team yeah? why did I set this what is this huh I said T I just set it as initially okay okay no problem and uh, the length of each let's increase it again to 100 mm, so three segments 20 trials turned off i think i can change the line color so the trials will appear as other as uh, other color and uh, i think it is set line style i think uh, here and style pattern thickness i think if i just set two okay comma one comma one okay so the line style is now like dotted but i don't want that and uh, i think which part is it line style i think zero and uh, two comma zero and one Let's see. What the hell? Okay. So this is the line style. Can I think set C O N O R and color five and remove this? I think just only that will work. 
yeah so now i will set color here five and uh, where i am drawing the line yeah so just uh, here set color back as one i guess Mm, not one I think zero zero is black yeah uh what the f okay anyway so we got it and there is the line thickness I saw it so if we can uh, just set it at the start set line style line style zero my pattern zero comma thickness of yeah look cool yeah I think only for the trials I will set it like that or only for the line Okay, I think the overlaps are overlapping, the trials are overlapping the line. So, how can we calibrate? I will not go on to that. So, we got the point. That's how it works, guys. And uh, right, let's say increase the segments of the, the points of the line to, to 10 and the length reduced to 50. Yeah. Multiple pendulum. This looks like a uh, Radar scanning the area. Hmm. So I just make it a little prime empty loop. Yeah, it looks cool. It is just showing the displacement of each point. All right, guys. So thanks for watching. And uh, if you want tutorials, stay tuned, subscribe and uh, give a like to this video and share it so thanks for watching subscribe